All right, this is Andrew with Jota Home Inspections. Today is May 17th, 2022, and we're doing a sewer scope here at 866 Brookside Lane in Centerville. Um, kind of a unique situation here, so what it looks like to me, um, and it'll make sense as we pull back, but I think this is the shower, the upstairs shower draining, and then you have a, a little bit of a blockage there. I think what's happening is the water is draining through the shower right there and it comes down the line and it's supposed to drop down that stack. Uh, the way they plumb this, it makes it kind of impossible to scope from the roof stack. I have water running from, uh, I have water running from the shower so if it's coming from above that actually can't be the shower. That's probably maybe a drain, uh, maybe the upstairs sink drain. I'm not positive, but in either case, it looks like you have a lot of buildup, some sort of a blockage there. Any sort of a blockage like that can lead to a backup. So it'd be good to have that cleaned out. Uh, but, but the other issue is that the way that this is plumbed, instead of having a proper sweep, you can't push the camera where it's going to curve down and continue down the stack. Instead, it's just hopping over the, the drain that it's supposed to go down and then, and then going through the other side of the drain. Uh, normally, we could pull a toilet um, and scope through there. This toilet's not installed right. Uh, I, I always check before I give the option of, of scoping through the toilet, and this toilet is missing at least one bolt. And so it's uh, once I cut the caulk and pull it up, it's not it's not going to sit right. We're not going to be be able to secure it. Uh, most of the time. You can just put in new bolts, but there's probably a reason why the one wasn't used to begin with. There's probably a, an issue there. And so I don't want to pull that toilet and then not be able to just put it back the way that it should be. Um, so I'd recommend a couple things. First, to have this drain, that blockage cleaned out. And then second, to have some sort of an access made or the toilet put on right so that we can remove it and, and do a scope um, fully third option, there might be another clean out hidden, maybe behind the washing machine or somewhere out in the yard that we could access. And so it would be good to ask the seller or HOA if there's any other known access points. I'm going to end this recording now.